over his last 20 fights. Schlemenko 17 and two with one no contest. 10 of those 17 wins coming by way of finish. It is our main event of the evening. Three rounds in the middleweight well, division. Paul Bradley versus Al Alexander Schlemenko. In the middleweight division. Now introducing your fighter in the blue corner. This fighter is 33 years old. He weighed in at 83.6 kilograms. He stands 175 centimeters tall and has a professional record of 23 wins and seven losses. He is ring of combat champion and veteran of UFC and Bellator from the United States of America. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Paul, the gentleman Bradley. And now welcome his opponent in the red corner. This fighter is 32 years old. He weighed in at 83.7 kilograms. He stands 180 centimeters tall and has a record of 54 wins, nine losses with one draw. He is two-time winner of Bellator Middleweight Grand Prix. And he is three-time Bellator Middleweight Champion, representing New Stream Team, Storm MMA School, and Russ Fighters Team. From Russia, Alexander Storm Shlomenko! And your referee for this bout, Marco Bruisen. Three rounds, five minutes. You both know the rules. Listen to my commands. Protect yourself all times. Make it a good match. Check hands if you want. Back to your corner. Marco Bruisen from the Netherlands, the referee. Paul Bradley from the United States versus Alexander Shlomenko from Russia. We're in Moscow. The main event, M175. Round number one. Really pleased that you're with us watching live online around the world. With the in the machine, Freeman, I'm Sean Wheelock. Black trunks for Bradley, white and blue trucks for Shlomenko. Well, Bradley closing the gap, gets the takedown. And he hits it. Well, like we said, he's got world-class wrestling. But can he keep Shlomenko down? Shlomenko is a world-class MMA fighter. You can hear the corner of Bradley saying, pull him back down. He's got a hold of the hips. If he pulls the hips out, he will put him on his back. This is exactly the start that Paul Bradley wanted. Successful in his first takedown attempt and on the mat in the opening minute of this fight. Shalenko being very patient, sitting up. Yeah, Shlomenko, he's high, so it's going to be very hard to pull the hips out. When they get high like that, you're pulling the whole body weight through. If he was a little bit lower and his backside was a little bit more away from the cage side of things, he would be able to pull his hips backwards. But he's sitting quite high. That's a strong position. Although sitting on his pants, he's in a strong position. Shlomenko keeps looking over to Burson, asking for the stand-up. Burson seeing enough activity from Bradley to keep this fight right where it is. Yeah, sometimes you can intimidate the referee by asking for a stand-up. But Marco Bruison is just too experienced. He's not going to listen to the fighter. Now there's the now stand he does up. it. Flamenco. Oh, oh. The with the left hand. He tagged him. Bradley right back to the inside. That was an aggressive stand up there from Flamenco. Bradley to the S grip. Knee to the body and another from Flamenco as he hits the turn. I saw blood on the back of Flamenco. Is it coming from the face of Bradley? This Moscow crowd fully behind Alexander Shlomenko now. We saw Bradley's range. This is Shlomenko's preferred and ideal range. Neither in the right hand, the counter from Shlomenko. Bradley back to the inside. Oh, he the, the knee! Change. That Eight was the knee dangerous. On the level change. That's a risk you have to take against a good striker like Flamenco. If you're going to drop down, you've got to drop down fast, and I mean super fast. The key word for Bradley is heavy. He wants to be heavy in the clinch and heavy on the ground. There's the separation from Burson. 
Bounce to the step of Bradley. She'll make her hands high and fixed. There's the kick, definitely blocked. Oh, right hand! Bradley needs to shoot on the knee. Jumpney Slamenko slips. Bradley trying to take full advantage to the inside. Good recovery from Bradley. But Slamenko is stuffing the takedown. Wrist control from Slamenko. Leaves go of the wrist, throws a punch. Nice left hand into the body now from Shlomenko. Even Shlomenko's body shots sound powerful. Oh, big left hand. A smile and a nod of come on from Paul Bradley as he walks forward and eats the knee again. Shlomenko's been practicing that knee. Shlomenko waving Bradley forward, swing and a miss. Bradley with the knee, that misses the mark. Oh, and again to the body. How many more can Bradley take? Shlomenko timing those level changes beautifully in those high shots from Bradley. Bradley looking for this scoop on the double leg. Referee tell him no holding. He's not holding, but he does have his elbow over. That's, there we go, he's holding now. He's holding with the armpit. Referee pulls the arm over. Burson again calling for action. The separation once more. Well, let's hope Bradley has been working on his cardio because all these takedown attempts is going to be exhausting. I can guarantee it. Short left hand on the hook from Schlemenko. Oh, the knee. Spares the spin of that fist. fist. Bradley comes back with a knee of his own. This has been outstanding thus far. Ten seconds remaining round number one. Action. Short knee from Bradley on the forearm. There is the bell. Machine in the year 2017 with two high quality fighters such as Paul Bradley and Alexander Shlomenko. It's just overly simplistic to say grappler against striker, but clearly Bradley wants this on the ground. Shlomenko wants this standing. You see Shlomenko in round number one, waving Bradley forward. The jump knee just off the mark, but the presence of mind of Shlomenko to then throw punches afterwards. Bradley eating that right hand as he tries to work in. Shlomenko throwing just one spinning back strike, but landed that huge right hand in round number one. We talked about that before the opening bell. Shlomenko always throwing and throwing from different angles to different and sometimes very unlikely targets. Well, watching that and the way that Shlomenko jumped up with a flying knee, he is not too bothered about closing the gap. He doesn't mind being in a clinch. He's obviously drilled not being taken down by Bradley. So he, he, he has got no worries about this clinch game. Round number two, Bradley off oh! the right flurry. Big knee again on the inside. Bradley Just can... when Bradley seemed to be coming forward with the punches, he takes a knee. Bradley continues to take knees from Shlomenko to the head and to the body. Drilling the liver there with his left hand. And again. Shlomenko digging that left hand to the body. Big on the kick and oh, the knee to the There's a knee to the liver. More knees, counter knee from Bradley. Shlomenko now opening up. Bradley Look tries to fire him. back. Jump knee once more on the switch knee. He is drilling the right hand side of Bradley's body. That is where your liver is. That is, as you can see, Bradley dropped his elbow there. He doesn't want to be hit there. Bradley climbing oh, low. Left hand. Left hand. Mouthpiece out. Bradley, Bradley complained about being hit in the groin. Referee's not having it. Mouthpiece right back in. Bradley, you see those wide punches to the body. Slamenko walking through them. There's the head kick. Knee to the body from Bradley. Bradley trying to work into the tie plumb. Again, drilling that body. And again. Short right hands now from Bradley. Big knee from Shlomenko. This could be the beginning of the end. 
Bradley with that head oh, kick so of his moves backwards. Bradley using the head kick to close distance and initiate this clinch. Jamaica continuing to dig those hooks to the body, to the rib cage of Bradley. Paul, where's your head position? The thing is with Bradley, he just cannot finish the takedown. Not down to his skill, but down to the skill of Shlomenko. Foot stomp from Bradley. Bradley hit the first takedown he attempted in the opening minute of this fight. That's the only time these two fighters have been on the mat in this bout. But he didn't really secure it because Shlomenko was on the seat of his pants. Shlomenko, hands high. High inside kick. Both guys trading now. Once Bradley. again, Bradley goes in for the clinch. Bradley is eating some big shots and still showing the will and the heart to move forward. Now working tie clinch, lets it go. Blue corners, Bradley's right corner, Shlomenko's. Separation from Shlomenko, Bradley again walks forward. Oh, nice knee. Hand. The knee has been a signature tune from Shlomenko. Shlomenko's been oh, timing. again, and again! Bradley in trouble now. He's in big trouble. He's got to hold the arm. Person taking a really close look. Shlomenko looking to finish. Knee in the body again. He's not allowed to knee the head in that position. Now we can. Bradley back to his feet. He was a grounded opponent there. That's why Shlomenko can only knee the body legally. Body lock again from Bradley. And the separation. We're not seeing the level changes from Bradley because he took so many big knees early on in this fight. And Just again like with that. the knee. Oh, there's only so many your body can take. Shlomenko has obviously been drilling this fight. Jump switch knee again from Shlomenko. I've never seen Shlomenko throw as many knees in a fight. He's obviously been drilling this back in the gym. He knows if a guy shoots in, the best thing to do is throw a knee. Bradley looking to turn. Shlomenko effective in his own clinch, then the short right hand. Shlomenko breaks free. Spinning back fist. Spinning, oh, spinning back, back kick. kick, sorry. He feints it with the spinning back fist. Hey, kick, that's the slip. Bradley off balance. 15 seconds remaining, round number two. Oh, knee to the body. Again, you see Bradley grounded. Shlomenko, though, can't punch the head just as he's doing opening up. Referee may stop it. Massive swings. Bradley smiles, says, come on, walks forward. That is the end of round two. Well, hats off to Bradley. He's surviving. But that body is pummeled. I first met Alexander Shlomenko seven years ago next month. He fought Matt Major, wound up winning that fight by unanimous decision. In the pre-fight meeting, Shlomenko said, my knees are a gift from God. And as I've seen him and called numerous Shlomenko fights over the seven years in the interim, you see the full force of those knees. We're seeing those knees in this fight, just like that which dropped Bradley. Vicious knees from Alexander Shlomenko in this fight. That was Bradley on the slip. Shlomenko is on his feet already. Former Bellator welterweight champion, Andre Korshkov, in the champion of his mentor, the former Bellator middleweight champion, Alexander Shlomenko. Third and final round. Our well, main event from Moscow, M1 Challenge 75, Paul Bradley versus Alexander Shlomenko. Well, I heard the corner man of Bradley. He said, come on, Paul. It's not about how tough you are, it's about being active. He's definitely been tough, there's no one can deny that. Action, come on. The punishment his body has taken and he's still moving forward. 
Machine, you know as well as I do, as MMA has evolved, tough means you're losing. Rarely do you hear a fighter described as tough who is winning a fight. Yeah, tough normally means you're taking punishment. Bradley is tough, and he's taking punishment in this fight. But credit to Paul Bradley, still walking forward, but Shlomenko has been unloading with punches, with knees, with kicks, and another knee and another. Oh, wow. Those knees have been perfect. And toughness to the positive. Fighter less tough than Paul Bradley. This is game set match for Shlomenko. We're not in round three. Corner men are shouting to Bradley, break away and punch. The takedown is not going to work. He knows that Shlomenko is hard to take down, so he has to break free and punch. Bradley throwing those left hands. Shlomenko throwing right back with the right hand. The level changes, though, have largely disappeared from Bradley. Shlomenko stepped to the side as if he was going to throw a spin and back fist. Shlomenko fainting with the kick. Bradley again comes forward. Bradley throwing the right hand into the clinch. Knee again from Shlomenko, short left hand. Yeah, Shlomenko is winning the close quarter battle. When Bradley was hitting those level changes in the opening round, Shlomenko was timing the knees beautifully. Separation ordered by Marco Barusa, 245 remaining third and final It's not round. just a punishment that the body's taking with pain. It takes it out of you energy-wise also. It zaps your energy. Big exhale from Bradley. Swing and a miss. Shlomenko breaks free. Again with those knees. The evolution of Alexander Shlomenko in MMA, he's gone from being a pure striker to a striker with very good defensive grappling. Not offensive grappling, but defensive grappling. Keep it in your mouth, Against the two-time NCAA Division I wrestling All-American and Paul Bradley. And Shlomenko has only been taken down once. It's extremely impressive. Again, the break ordered the separation from Borussia. Shlomenko back to the center of the ring. Bradley meets him there. 140 remaining in this fight. Big swing and a miss over the top of the right hand from Bradley. Well, this would be a, a fairy tale come true with Bradley come forward and win this fight from here. There was but the level change and there was the knee. Shlomenko has timed that knee perfectly every time. He's gonna push on the head and break free. Shlomenko wow. can see the finish line now. The referee could step in. Can he reach it? Burson again taking a really close look. Bradley to his feet. Bradley did well to get back to his feet there. Nice head movement from Shlomenko. Changing the position, getting to the outside, now the left hand. Bradley still coming forward, eats oh. the kick. And again with those knees, and another. Bradley, Bradley has the single. Bradley determined to hit it. 30 seconds remaining in this fight. Bradley paid the price to latch on to the single. Every single time that Bradley has gone in for a level change, Slamenko has timed it with a knee either to the body or to the head. Well, Bradley's trying to get that takedown. He needs more than a takedown right now. He needs a finish. And Slamenko is making him pay. Spinning back fist in the left hand. Bradley says, come on, back to the center of the ring. Faints on the jump knee once more. Final seconds and there's the bell. Well, Bradley can say, you beat me, but you never broke me. He managed to last the distance, but not without pain to the body from those knees, Sean. I'll use tough as a compliment there. Paul Bradley, extremely tough in that fight. Withstood tremendous shots. And Alexander Shlomenko, 
showing why he is one of the top middleweights and one of the top pure strikers in all of MMA. А также президент группы компании Newstream Новый Поток Дмитрий Мазуров. Shulmenko knew his path to victory was to keep this fight standing. Another than a takedown hit by Bradley on his very first attempt of the fight in the opening minute of the fight, Shulmenko kept this fight standing. Look of amusement on the face of Bradley. Just could not fully implement his game plan which was to take Shlomenko down and keep Shlomenko down. Well, ladies and gentlemen, after three rounds of action, we go to the judges' scorecard for a unanimous decision in favor of your winner, Alexander!